When do you feel the most alone? Away from prying eyes and intrusive questions, when it's truly silent. It can be comforting sometimes, when your presence has often been treated as a problem. No matter how hard you try to assimilate, you will always be seen as a foreigner. As family and friends are left behind, you leave parts of your identity with them. You slowly slip into the crowd. Around year, year nine, year eight, year nine, that's when I kind of like let go of my own kind of, lost sight of my identity a little bit and then kind of just went with the crowd and then kind of got more into the sports I played, more into the, I, I don't know, I guess, like, like talk to more kind of like the, those who were considered the, the popular lot. You try your hardest to fit in, but no matter how hard you try, they'll always see you different, treat you different. You look at yourself. What does it mean to be black? What does it mean to be me? There was a lot of sort of like teasing and you know, that kind of thing. And I would say like mum did, she stepped in a lot to like really defend me. And I know that wasn't always good maybe for you and Daniel, but for me, like it was really good because you have people sort of talking about what you look like, your hair or whatever it is. So mum would just like come in and really defend me all the time. You start to think it must be you that's the problem. My skin, my hair, is it so funny? I'm only here for everyone else's entertainment. Raising Kesia, it was not, it was quite hard. I mean, at the beginning, I mean, Kesia always took a little while to sort of settle. I mean, uh, she wanted to move back at some point, but then she started liking it. The, the young children at, 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 uh, at the time, they were not very used to having black uh, children uh, around them. Kesia was the only black girl, black child in the, in the entire school she went. Although Kesia was quite tracky, sort of quite dark, quite popular in some way amongst the kids, but some ch some children sort of would accept her. Everyone expects you to know. Expects you to achieve comfort in your own skin whilst you're still learning your ABCs. My parents gave me what I needed to do with school and work. What about everything else? The constant grinding down of who you are. Your uniqueness despised instead of celebrated. Your history erased. I I think on paper I had like the things that I knew um, about like race and why like at that time told myself because you know it wasn't really something that was taught to me in school or anything like that. Um, it's just things that you know. Uh, was it, like around that time I got more into like Malcolm X and what he kind of his message um, so I was aware of that on like, um, kind of like on paper but I, uh, my personal kind of how I approached my own blackness was still kind of in progress the distance starts to take its toll as you do everything in your power to stay in contact with your family but it never quite feels the same at the beginning, it was a bit difficult because it was so facilities that we have now. But even now, we got a lot of facilities you can do again. You can, you know, there's uh, Messenger, there's WhatsApp, there's all those things. You know, at the beginning, it was really hard to write. There was no, there was no, even call. The call was just very expensive. We could afford it. You know? When do you feel the most alone? 
especially like year 10 and 11, I had a good friendship group. I was using music as a way to have a, have an outlet. It was like a, you know, it's like a diary in a way, or like a journal. I was like, I'm not, I'm still going to do this with my hair because this is not just a fashion statement for me. Like, this is me looking after my hair, this is me doing something for different. I think about like skate culture and like, um, having different music tastes and things. Um, but that, that comes from progression as well. I think it's so important that you do have a family that you know you are each other's support system you know assist one another sort of help one another support of one another